The Waterfront Historic Area League, known as Whale, is the only historic restoration nonprofit in the country that is also a community development corporation. We undertake complex restoration projects that revitalize the New Bedford community. New Bedford, once a leading whaling port, is where the tale of Melville's Moby Dick begins. It is still a maritime city with buildings that tell the story of the past, like the Siemens Bethel and Mariner's home pictured here and recently restored by Whale. Whale was founded in reaction to urban renewal in the 1960s, when historic neighborhoods were cleared for new highways. Whale saved buildings that were supposed to be demolished and renovated and repurposed them. These pro properties remain a part of the heart and soul of the city and speak to the lives of the immigrants who built them. Today, New Bedford is a diverse gateway city with 43% of the population of Cape Verdean and Portuguese descent, as well as a growing Latino population. Neighborhoods suffer from disinvestment resulting in dilapidated buildings and a loss of community pride. Wales community development approach begins with identifying vacant historic buildings in danger of demolition, especially in underinvested neighborhoods. To determine the best reuse of the building, we engage the community, neighbors, businesses, city planners, and nonprofits. Next, we work with the restoration team, including architects and engineers, to design the reuse of the buildings. In every project, Whale incorporates green building practices. We are also undertake financial feasibility and can create a sustainable business plan for each project. Then we enlist investors. Whale has the expertise to gather a wide variety of resources for projects, including local, state, and federal grants, tax credits, and private philanthropy. With the funding secured, we begin the restoration work with a team consisting of staff, architects, construction crew, and volunteers to return the building to its original integrity with new community purpose. The result is a building transformed with a whole new life and a new story to tell, leading to a revitalized neighborhood with instilled community pride. Over the past five years, Whale has leveraged $15 million in funds to complete 11 restoration projects. In the process, we've created jobs, and economic opportunities. Here is some of our work. We restored a whaling merchant's mansion to create seven units of affordable housing. An 1830 Cape Verdean's whaleman's home was restored to serve 20 veterans for transitional housing. The newly opened project is currently housing veterans infected with COVID-19, a sign of the times. The director of the veterans program said, without the leadership of Whale, this building would have been lost and now is providing a great service to the veteran community. Currently, Whale is working with the Cape Verdean Association to convert a former vaudeville theater into a cultural center. The adjacent weed infested lot you see in the picture will become a park with a mural celebrating the island immigrant community. This will create a transformative gateway to the district known as the International Marketplace. Also in the International Marketplace, we are working with a nonprofit partner on the restoration of a film theater to be a mixed use economic center. We are under construction on the restoration of the 1829 First Baptist Church once a famous meeting house that was the birthplace of Robert's Rules of Order. It will have a whole new life as a community theater. We are partnering with a nonprofit to restore foreclosure for a downtown LGBTQ community center. 
the only such center in the entire South Coast. And finally, we are restoring a historic firehouse for eight affordable apartments. Our goal over the next two years is to grow our capacity to undertake restoration projects like these that'll revitalize low-income neighborhoods. To do so, we must increase our small staff of four by adding a project manager and a community outreach coordinator. And we must grow our capital fund from 350,000 to 750,000. We are looking for an investment of 850,000 over the next two years to help us grow our capacity to do our work. With your help, Whale and its partners will continue to propel New Bedford and all its great diversity into a future that can rival its celebrated past and its old buildings will continue to speak to new generations. Thank you so much. Thank you.